Welcome back to Android Q&A. My name is Jace, and today we tackle the most common questions surrounding the Nexus 5. Like, does it support Qualcomm Quick Charge 2.0? Does it support USB OTG? And what kind of warranty do I get when I buy the Nexus 5 from the Google Play Store? Buy me now, please. Okay, stop, you're getting a little creepy. All right, friends, I've made no secret that I love this phone, but there were a lot of popular or common tech questions. And number one was, does the Nexus 5 support Qualcomm Quick Charge 2.0? Well, no, not really. Well, you see, the Nexus 5 has the Snapdragon 800 and that supports Qualcomm Quick Charge 2.0, but manufacturers can choose not to implement the feature. The Nexus 5 uses a Texas Instrument chip for battery charging and power path management, which does not support Qualcomm Quick Charge. So even with a firmware update, you are out of luck. Now, does the Nexus 5 support USB OTG? Yes, just like the Nexus 7, which means storage cannot auto mount and you'll need an application that can access it. Now, if you have a rooted device, you can use stick mount. If you're not rooted, then you can use Total Commander and the USB mount plugin. You can find all those links provided below. Moving on to the all important warranty question. The following is what Google says on their own support site. If you purchase a device or accessory from the Google Play Store and it is defective through no fault of your own, you may be entitled to a refund, replacement, or a repair of your device. Please contact us and we will work with you in the next steps and replacement options. Basically, you have to go through Google's following refund process. First, you have to contact Google and initiate a return within 15 days of receiving your device. The next step is to return the item to Google within seven days after receiving your return purchase authorization. Then when the item arrives at Google, you will receive a refund within 14 business days. Now there's also a manufacturer's warranty directly from LG and I went to LG's website where they state that they provide a one year coverage on both parts and labor. Next up is a really important question for those of you who want to make sure that your Nexus phone will be compatible with your carrier. How do I know what model I am buying when I order from the Google Play Store? That depends on where you purchased your phone. If you bought it in North America, you have the D820, which has LTE bands for AT&T, Sprint, Rogers, Telus, Wind, and T-Mobile. Now, if you're ordering from outside North America, you are buying the D821, which has LTE band. Thanks for watching Android Army. My name is Jace. Love to connect with you here on Google Plus or Twitter. Don't forget about my brothers in Android, Josh, Joe, and the Tech Ninja, Kevin, Lon, and Chris. We're all one big happy Android family. And if you have any more questions about your Nexus 5, put them in the comments below. If I can't answer them, I'm sure someone else will. I shall see you next time on Android Q&A.